I can't never say I've had a coach quite like Coach James. He uh, was really unique in the way his style of coaching, his way of talking to us. I could tell he really cared for us. After a few years leading the men and women's golf team at East Texas Baptist University, Coach James was beginning his first season as head coach at the University of Southwest. Tragically, he and six other student athletes were killed in a car crash as they were headed back from a golf tournament in Midland Tuesday night, leaving the ETBU community in disbelief. I've never really lost someone that I've known like that in a way like this, so it's tough for me to kind of process and I'm I was just really sh shook whenever I heard the news this morning. Coach James was more than a coach, but a man of wisdom who didn't shy away from sharing the gospel on and off the field. It was more than about just golf. Uh, he was able to uh, pour into hit the lives of our student athletes uh, and how they interacted in the classroom, in the community, but also spiritually. And he used golf as a form of ministry, uh, and he ministered to our student athletes uh, when he was when he was coaching them and interacting with them. His interactions with the team have left lifelong impacts on members like who will continue to carry out his legacy this season. And I think as the season goes forward, we can look at this as a time of trying to do it for him and also a time to be our best selves in this situation and to just work hard as a team. And I know that he would want us to succeed. And I think if we work hard, we can continue his legacy that way. In Marshall, I'm Ashley French for CBS 19.